Hey everyone, Chris the Thrift Shop Hustler. I know it's been a while since we did a Know Your Stuff, but I got a really special one for you today. I want to wish everyone a happy new year for 2018. I appreciate all the new subscribers. We're at 3,100 subscribers. I think we're pushing a little bit over that, so we just hit 3,000 subscribers a couple weeks ago, so I definitely really appreciate that. If you're not subscribed to the channel, please click the subscribe button below, and anytime this, during this video, please click the like button and leave a comment if you have any questions. Today I have a very special Know your stuff. We're actually going to talk about Borowski glass from Poland. And I know about this stuff from a while ago because um, when I ran a collectible shop, I did their eBay stuff. Uh, we came across some of this stuff before, so I thought it'd be an excellent chance to put a video together for you guys. And 99.9% and .9 of you probably have never heard of this glass. And if you did, congratulations. This is some really kind of niche stuff. And definitely something that you know you should be on the lookout for so let me just start off by saying for the most part you're gonna find Borowski sculptures mostly at estate sales I mean you could come across them at, a, uh, at garage sales and yard sales and thrift shops but chances are you're probably not the people that own these these are pretty high-end pieces of glass they did do ornaments and little boxed figures that were a little uh, less expensive for, for the most part the sculptures ran into like you know the hundreds of dollars if not the thousands of dollars depending on the size so anyways let me just start back it up a little bit what uh, this was started by Stanislaw Borowski in 1990 started his glass studio and you can tell the kind of uh, 1990s kind of hip funkiness to these things and, and the, one of the things that you can tell real quick about these and let's get into this real quick there we go. That feels much better. As you can see, they're little they're pretty much like animals and they got this really amazing color and shine to them. There's definitely very unique color palettes and very vibrant colors. So that's one of the things that'll stick out to you if you see these out and about. So like I said, uh, Stanislaw Borowski started this in 1990. His sons took over the glass studio I want to say sometime after that and they've still doing this stuff to the day this is out of Poland so finding this kind of stuff in the US is gonna be a little difficult but there is this stuff around I just want to basically do this video to show you guys what to look for in the specifically you know the little hallmarks and all that kind of stuff because you could definitely come across this stuff and I want to say you're most likely going to come across the Christmas bulb ornaments than anything else. And we'll get into that in a second. So let's jump into here real quick. As you can see, Studio Borowski, this is actually a gallery. Um, can't pronounce that. But anyways, this is a gallery and it shows some of the previous pieces over the last 20 something years. Lucky Bird right here I've seen on eBay before. And uh, this one actually is a culmination of different um, metals and glass. And that's another thing, too. Uh, they do like they've done like yard kind of sculptures and things like that. And if you could find those, those go for thousands of dollars. And anyways, like I said, if you're going to find these, just make sure they're not broken. This is glass and they're pretty they're they're pretty well made, especially the smaller ones. But the larger sculptures that are taller these things can easily be broken so you're probably not going to find these at a thrift shop because at the thrift shop let's be honest they treat everything just like garbage as far as just like throwing it around it just they don't take care of anything like i said i pulled that painting out the other day um and uh that was just it, you can tell like it was just all whatever so anyways what you want to look for is these little kind of animals and they very stick out they're very bright vibrant and we can go into here this is the Borowski website and I'll leave a link down to this below it's pretty interesting to see the stuff that they're making and there's the father and the sons doing their own thing they're still doing this they're still coming out with work and definitely their animals are what they're probably most well known for as the sons have uh, the basically the father is the one who came up with all this or started this business and his sons <clears throat> quickly took over as they had also had artistic ability and it does take uh, quite the artistry skill to blow glass and shape glass glass is an interesting medium I've never done any kind of glass art before but I know people in my sphere of influence that have and I'll tell you what it does take a very long time 
of learning and failing before you get anything right. What's very nice about the Borowski um, website is they have catalogs and you can see here this is one of them you can download them they they're very fast and I want to show you guys the outdoor objects here these are amazing like if I if I came across these I don't even know if I'd want to sell them because they're so beautiful as far as their art and they're huge ass sculptures so I'm just saying like chances of you finding these in a yard sale or like an estate sale is going to be slim because these things still go for an amazing amount of money. So much so that you have to almost inquire about pricing because they don't advertise their prices anywhere. Also, they're not in U.S. dollars. They have a, a certain other kind of currency they got going on here. But these sculptors are amazing. <clears throat> but it wouldn't be a Know Your Stuff video without actually going on eBay. This is the real meat and potatoes of everything. As you can see here, we have some uh, glass sculptures. This one went for 1400 this one, someone took a best offer. It looks like a crocodile bull. And uh, there's the birds. The birds, that you can find a lot of birds. And there's all these little tiny ones, too. As you can see here, this Borowski whim Whimsical. They make little boxed figures. And let's see if they have the box in this one. Uh, sort of. But anyways, this is the thing I want to show you guys. You see this Borowski glass? This one says Germany, made in Poland. This is, must have been sold out of Germany. But Borowski's has this hallmark of a little silver sticker. They've always had these, which is really good for basically showing you what's up. And this is a signature down here. It looks like one of the... Uh, I don't know if that's one of the sons. I think that's one of the sons' newer signatures. Some of the glass pieces will actually be uh, uh, etched or engraved with their signatures on the bottom because these are very limited edition. Oh, here's the Christmas bulbs I was talking about. To be honest, you're most likely going to find one of these bulbs, and they're considered actually pieces of art. And uh, here's actually a, a gold Borowski sticker. I haven't seen a gold one in a while. Usually you're going to find the silver stickers. Let me see if we can look in here real quick. In this one, the sil usually the ornaments have the silver stickers. This one doesn't even have a sticker. And th that's going to be one of the hardest things to tell is if you find one of these without the sticker, um, it's going to be very hard to tell. You'd have to compare it with something else that's previously been made. But for the most part, a glass ornament bulb is going to look amazing. You're going to know it's going to be a piece of art. Here's, a, here's another uh, sticker like I was saying. And these are the most common stickers as another good photo, no, not high end. Uh, this one went for $30. This is actually a really good price if you can find any of these between like 20 and $40, especially the things. These are really nice pieces of art. They're all hand blown. They're not made in a factory somewhere like, but they're actually individually blown and taken where Cali like, I mean, these prices for these are actually really amazing. And they're honestly amazing works of art. As you can see here, amazing. You see, look at those, look at those colors, and th just the way that they're blown, and the kiln and everything turns all these colors into these amazing, these amazing sculptures. Anyways, we used to sell these a long time ago in a collectible shop, and uh, we used to have a few of the sculptures. But the bigger sculptures, like I said, are going to go for a pretty good amount of money. This one is happens to be an outdoor one from North Carolina, of all places. Probably directly from... Oh, these are so amazing. So anyways, I want you guys to let you know about Borowski Glass. And to definitely look out for this stuff because it's out there. Anyways, I'm Chris, the Thrift Shop Hustler. Thank you guys for tuning in. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like button. Subscribe and click the notification bell if you want to be notified for new videos it's 2018 we're starting it off with get to know uh, get to know know your stuff Borowski glass i hope you guys learned a little bit of something so now you have a little bit of knowledge to go out there and if you come across this stuff even if you find different little glass sculptures definitely take a look underneath look at the hallmark and look it up while you're at the thrift shops and estate sales all right guys i'm chris the thrift shop hustler have a great week